Hi Gemini, welcome to my channel. This is a uh, weekly reading for the sign of Gemini. I hope you're doing well. This is applicable for singles, couples in a relationship, dating or getting to know. And this reading for today, it's what's ready for you. It's what it is what meant for you to know and ready for you to know for the incoming third week of September 2019. I have already shuffled the card and pre-picked the card for you. So let's start your reading Gemini. All right. And um You've got here, your first card is the Four of Swords in reverse and a Ten of Wands. Um, it's a difficult situation, okay? Because Ten of Wands, this is a person who's pushing everything by himself. Um, he's trying to move the Ten of Wands to the castle from his, from what, where he is, uh, going through the castle, all right? And it's, if you look at the, the position of the man here, he looks like he's injured but he's willing to take a risk willing to carry this ten of wands by himself even though it's um it's weighing him down it's a uh, physically it's it's um you know the physical strength is not equal to the amount of workload that this um this ten of wands is um is requiring you know her his physical strength is not equal to the to the weight of the ten of wands but if you look at his clothes it's yellow it's green so it, it's really more of i want to go ahead i want a green light i want to do it so physically um the body is weak but his spirit is strong all right so there's an energy a situation where you are involved into into this um into this kind of um persuasion into this kind of strategy where someone is feeling really like you know what i feel so weak but i'm willing to do it again all right it is difficult but i'm with you let's try all over again all right it's difficult but i want to do it with you um the four of swords is in reverse it means that um it's stressful and anxiety there's an issue it's imbalance it's for some of you, you've been awakened and you've been pushed to drive something to reach an outcome. You know, it's it's a feeling of it's so hard. Why it's so hard? You know, it's so hard to be alone. It's so hard to do it by myself. But I can do it if you give me some sort of inspiration. You know, if you give me if you give me that love support, I will do it for you. I will wait for you. I, I will stand by you. All right. This is the feeling I'm getting from, you know, from these two cards. It could be you. It could be the person you're involved with who has this energy. Um, so these two cards in here, Gemini, it seems to be, you know, someone is convincing that, look, I'm weak. You know, I'm not perfect, but I will ride with you, baby. You know, and um, the other person, uh, they're quite confused as to whether believing this person's ability or the confusion is about having choices you know should i trust this person back or do i stick with sorting out my own issue all right so this two energy i'm getting here gemini it could be you it could be them you have personal you have individual issue the other person all right could be you or them but the other person is confused whether to believe this person that they could do it they could do it this time correctly um perfectly um or by themselves for some of you you're dealing with a person who has choices they're a little bit everywhere so it's hard to get someone's attention it's really more of like someone is working hard like i'm working my ass off to get this done to please you to make you love me to stay to fight for this relationship but the other person's concentration is a little bit everywhere so this is serious versus playing or very serious while this person is confused all right so you are in that kind of situation that's why you're not getting a good news all right there's a person here who's very confused they don't know what to do whether they believe their emotions it's a little bit everywhere staggered energy you know um seven of cups my emotion is like they for some of you i'm picking up they're considering the um they're considering this one this one and this one before they can make a decision that's why this hard working person who is physically weak but is willing to give it all and try again to this relationship connection or reconnection this person is not inspired because this person is not getting a good news from the other end 
from the connection from the other person the other person they cannot finalize their thoughts their feelings because they have got a lot to sort out this is seven of cups all right this is annoying for me you know seven of cups is that they have to go through a list of seven items seven things you know seven seven speaks about relationship in order for a person to finally come up with their final delicious De de decision they have to sort out the seven things you know things like one two three four five it's, it would take a bit of time for this person to to really make a choice and i felt like this is also comes up with i'm not ready i've got things to sort out before i actually um come to this you know come to aid you because this person needs help all right ten of wands this is an energy where i'm struggling but I'm willing to do it. But halfway, I need your help. Halfway, when this person is about to reach the castle, I'm really getting like it. it they might collapse physically. So this person needs a reliever. And this is the problem with the other person is that they cannot give their input to aid this person with the connection, reconnection, or the relationship because they're confused themselves. You know, they have their own issues to sort out before they could jump into this. Or this is as simple as if it's getting to know or dating. Your person has, they're busy. You know, they, they couldn't come up with a final decision. It's hard for this person to decide given that there are seven cups in front of them to experience, to sort out, to feel, to understand. All right, so it, it, it's, it's an upfront message for for this person whoever is trying hard that you might be disappointed because when you reach the castle it will be by it could be just you all right you might not be able to see this person inside the castle the person that you want to be in a relationship connection or reconnection okay because page of wands they couldn't give you a final outcome input um, a share you know a fair share of their responsibility because you know they need to sort themselves out first all right um, the next three card, this seems to be the advice, the outcome is that, you know, keep your energy with you. Keep yourself balanced, emotional, physically, and mentally because you need that. Yourself need yourself, all right? Do you get my point? So the first person that you need to take care is yourself because this person that you are supporting, you're loving, you're liking, it seems to be, um, I'm on my um, I, I need to prioritize myself. So if you're weak, you know, this 10 of wands, if you're weak, you cannot aid. If you're not physically, emotionally, and mentally whole and healthy, then there's no point for you to help assist someone who's not willing to assist you, all right? So it seems to be there is um, some sort of a an advice to keep your energy, uh, feelings, emotion, to be healthy. Love yourself, fix yourself before you fix another person all right keep keep mom like i'm really getting follow your mom follow someone's advice you know it could be you're, you're working hard making things possible for this relationship connection or reconnection and yet, yet you don't realize how much work you put into you just feel tired you know so there's gonna be a person around you that would be watching you and seeing that's not good darling you're doing all the work for this person who doesn't deserve it. So it's a reminder for you that if you're feeling tired, let go. Actually, that is, you know, let go of the wands. This is the 10 wands and your last last card is let go. Okay, you don't need to invest all of your time to a person who is not ready. I'm not saying that this person is not going to be ready for their entire life. But it could be right now they aren't into you versus you to them. Because Ten of Wands, let go, all right? Let go, release the Ten of Wands. Don't try so hard, especially if it's just you who's trying to build something, all right? Let go of the Ten of Wands. You can invest, but it should be, you know, two Wands because Eight of Wands in reverse. Let go of some other stuff. Let them pick it up, you know? Um, it's, it's really, it's delegate, you know? Because the world will still go and revolve and will survive, so you better take care of yourself first before you love another person. The death card. Also, don't try so hard. You know, do it naturally. Do what you can do. 
and if 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 you're doing your input your effort isn't you know isn't enough to make this person happy or reply then leave it you know it's the death card is is something like natural it is you know something that needs to end in order to you know um the death card is death is something that's inevitable to happen so probably your situation that is that something that you need to accept naturally gradually this could happen and all you have to do is to let go in order to reset the button or to start fresh again but one of the main point in here like main thing for you to take on gemini take care of yourself love yourself first before you you give an assistance to someone else your person seems to be a little bit everywhere they aren't in touch with love they need to be they need to sort out themselves first confuse that's why they're not giving you some good news or passionate reply versus you to them okay someone in here is willing to make it happen but you know at but I felt like they will be tired. They will be needing some sort of assistance where this person will be disappointed because the assistance that they're waiting or the support that they're waiting for is still confused. It's still so far behind, all right? Still so far behind from the work. So, um, yeah, this is for you, Gemini. Thanks for your time. Thanks for being here. It's a pleasure doing this to you guys. If you like the reading, don't forget to click like and don't forget to click subscribe. I'll see you soon again. You take care, guys. Bye-bye.